Okay, everyone, today my goal is just to review the binary tree problem. I think I can do that. <laughs> um, so, um, so we're finding the maximum depth of a binary tree, and given the root of a binary tree, return its maximum depth. Binary tree's maximum depth is the number of nodes along with the longest path from root node to the farthest leaf index. So in this case, it's three, one, two, three. Okay, so the way to navigate the tree is to have an array that you push the root on course if you don't have a root then you return zero now we're going to update a variable for max okay so the way to navigate the binary tree is using a while loop with a for loop inside of it And so what the for loop is iterating over are the binary um, nodes, these nodes, these children. The children of the parent are going to be added. So that's going to be done with another variable level, which is equal to array.length. So while I while we have stuff added into our level, basically, basically we're gonna toggle in between the two. Uh, with this for loop, we just look at both one, two. We add them. Um, so we're gonna do two things. We're gonna so the level the size is two. So the computer knows we're gonna do two things. Um, and so the condition for the array is while the array dot length is greater than zero. So the terminating condition um, is that we're removing stuff um, from the array as we look at them. So we're gonna have a variable that's let current node equal to array dot shift which takes the element from the beginning of the array and then we will make a judgment um, so we are going to write current node dot left so if there is something uh, if it has a child uh, then we'll push it onto the array and add it to our queue basically I'm going to make this bigger. And then we do the same thing for the right. then you return max. So what are we doing here? Now that it's all written out before us, you can easily see there is a structure and we are pushing on the initial number three into the array. And then we check the node value that has that value, it's this one, three, and we look at its children. Um, so the uh, while loop is uh, currently the array is one and so the level is one and 
that will change when we get to these when it becomes two and uh, we basically remove these from the array and then ask if that parent has children on the left and right and if they do add them to the array and continue the cycle and all the while max is getting updated so max plus plus 